Now, no one gets to do work that they love all day, every day, 24 seven. It doesn't exist. That's not what this is. And this isn't a message of go do what you love. This is a message of find what you love in the work. In fact, the research shows the magic number is 20%. Can 20% of the time, can I do work that I love? More than that, it's diminishing returns. It starts to peter off. And so our opportunity here, and, and my hope as you leave, is first self-reflective of, can I find the love in my work? Not all the time, not every day, some of the time. Because as leaders, first I show and I demonstrate through my actions. If you don't have the love, how in the world are you gonna help your people find the love? So I have to find my love 20% of the time. And then can I help my people find their love and help them do more of that every single day so that they expand in their experience of love in their work. And then your final mission is to simply love your people. I believe you cannot be a leader today unless you love people. And there is no, you, we can give a round of applause for that. You can't be a leader today unless you love people. You can't. And I have some clients and you maybe work, uh, nobody in this room, but you maybe work for some of them. They look at me I, I, in my rooms and they sit back and they'll be like, love my people, Seth, I barely love my family. Asking me to love my people, my staff? Yes. Yes, love. Love them as a fellow human being. Love them as someone you want goodness for them in their life. Even if that means maybe they're not going to stay on the team. Loving someone might mean letting them go and that is okay. Find the love. Help your people find the love. Love your people. And we do that and we will collectively in this moment own our chance to not revert back to what was but to create what's new and blaze this new trail thank you for a great afternoon thanks so much gang thank you